Welcome to the Mobile World Congress 2016. Mobile is no longer just in our pockets. Mobile is all around us. What's coming up next is the next step beyond 4G. The broad range of technologies called 5G is what permeates every single stand here. In fact, it's the foundation of 5G that makes everything that we ever think about in the future possible. Whether it's smart cities, whether it's quantified self, whether it's self-driving cars, these are only possible in a world where there's low latency and there's no data loss at any particular moment in time. We live in an organic world, so everything is connected nowadays. Now, needless to say, 5G is all about connecting people. But the way that this is going to explode, it's going to be about connecting the industries. So one of the more everyday brands that's kind of really grasped the metal when it comes to Internet of Things and, and kind of smart products is Oral-B, P&G company. Actually, it is genuinely smart. It uses sensors. Um, you put your smartphone on the mirror in front of you as you brush your teeth. Um, and it can tell the areas in your mouth that you don't brush enough. So I think it, that's a really exciting example of a brand that isn't a mobile brand, it's not an operator, it's not a handset maker, it's not even a technology company, um, but using the, the power of mobility to not only sell products but also make people healthier in the long run too. So when it comes to VR, the difference between this year and last year was VR was kind of tucked into the corner of the big stand and there would be kind of one headset. This year there are whole theatres devoted to VR. There's a roller coaster at the Samsung stand that you can visit to have a, a really interactive VR experience. There's a VR submarine. There's headsets all over the place. People are giving away headsets. So what's the relevance to all this virtual reality? So all the devices apart from HTC Vive, all the devices we saw at Mobile World Congress are completely enabled and compatible with mobile devices. You don't need to invest in the hardware. All you need is the head-mounted device, so the operating system is in your pocket. Mobile is enabling this next revolution of how people are going to consume content and how they're going to step into this new virtual world of immersive experiences. As we start to think about media in new ways, as we start to think less about channels and more about experiences that surround people, we can really see the profoundness of big data and personal data in that world. Now, if you accept that our mobile devices are with us the whole time, they're connected to the internet, they have our financial details, we use them to make decisions every moment of the day, and we can place messages at any moment using rich personal data in that context. This is the greatest opportunity that advertising has ever known, and it's the most exciting opportunity for us to explore today. What I've noticed here today is uh, something which is uh, coming out in the industry. It's a great marriage between creativity and data. It's something which is exceptional, and it's going to change the way we are going to see and uh, use mobile advertising in the future. Uh, creativity is getting extremely powerful. You will see 360 video, uh, rich media content, virtual reality on mobile, so you've got to have more and more engaging content on mobile. And on the other side, you have data, a lot of data about people that we can enable programmatically to buy more precise audience segments and basically to be very precise and relevant when we are talking with people. Uh, there's a huge traction on being able to target better the campaigns, the mobile audiences that is like out there. So we are seeing at the same time scale on the audience side coming from all these vendors that are here and on the other we have the ability to address the scale with the proper tools to find the good people that really matter for our clients. Massive step change from what we saw last year. Last year what we saw is promises. We heard a lot of things that were going to happen. Today what we're seeing is the real life application of all of that. Thanks for joining us here in Barcelona at the Mobile World Congress. We hope you found these insights useful and we look forward to seeing you next time.